All right, we are the Hebrew Israelite coming out again, as always, every week to prophesy the downfall of America and to uh, hope as, as we out here preaching the word of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai that this word fall on the ears of the hopeful elect. You know, before I go any further, I'd like to give all praises and glory to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai for giving us the spirit to come out here and push his word. You know, this place you know is America. The, the, the Holy Bible calls it Babylon, or the Most High Power. Yeah, get your get her. Yeah, because she scoffed in her, cause she probably scoffed in her mind, you know? Yeah, yeah. She probably scoffed in her mind. But in, in the Holy Scriptures, the, it's, uh, America is known as Babylon. Babylon the Great, the mother of harlots, it's also known as Assyria, uh, Egypt, you know, this place is going down, man, and knowing that this place is going down, hey, uh, you know what, grab 2 Peter chapter 3, go to verse, uh, find the verse where it says, uh, and knowing that all these things should be dissolved. What man a person are you? Three and eleven. Thief in the knife. You want eleven? Okay. Second Peter three, verse eleven. Now hold on real quick before you bring that out. <clears throat> the the men that the Most High have woken up to this truth. And uh, certain sisters also, uh, well, you know that, yeah, certain sisters that woke up and they know that they're Israelites, I'm gonna say that. Uh, but I'm directing this to the men, you know, that's out on the highways and byways preaching. We know what time it is. The one, the ones of us that, that follow the uh, the teachings of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai under the, uh, the banner of Great Millstone, our apostles. The apostles of Great Millstone, we know that uh, <clears throat> Yahweh Shai is on his way back. We know that the nuclear destruction is on its way because we got the war, uh, not we, Salakia. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai got the war brewing in the Middle East. You know? So the, <clears throat> the stage is set for World War III. That's what's going to bring. Uh, the nuclear destruction uh, and annihilate what you know as America. We know the race riots are coming, you know, and in essence, all this is set up by the Heavenly Father, Yahweh. You know, even though he's using men on the earth <coughs> to execute his will, you know, <coughs> and knowing that uh, martial law is on his way, Biological warfare, you know. <clears throat> what what's some other things? The, uh, the RFID microchip, yeah. the mark of the beast. That's here, you know. And really, all these things are here. Is <clears throat> is ready? They ready to go, you know. Yahweh just got to give the order. When he give the order, things are gonna be executed in the earth. The, the prophecies are going to be uh, fulfilled, you know? Now, knowing all these things, uh, that's why I wanted you to bring this scripture out. You know, what should we be, uh, how should I, where should our mind be at? You know, bring that out, all right? Come it's 2 Peter 3, verse 11. Seeing then that all these things shall be dissolved, what manner of persons ought ye to be in all holy conversation and godliness? Right, so <clears throat> how should you be walking in this truth, knowing that destruction is coming? <clears throat> knowing that Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai can take the spirit of truth from you, you know? 
you should be concerned with edification of the brotherhood, edification of <clears throat> of yourself. You know, building up yourself, building up your brothers, teaching things that that uh, can get you get you salvation. That can get you on the chariot of uh, Israel. You know, not teaching. Uh, false philosophies and getting caught up in uh basically straining out a neck basically uh, getting puffed up you know oh this place is about to go down i'm running out of time because i think that I, I believe that i believe some some brothers believe that uh or some niggas i ain't gonna call them brothers because <clears throat> a nigga think like this <clears throat> oh things almost you know it's almost over I need to make a name for myself before the destruction hit. Mm. You know, I want to be, I want to get glorified, you know, and be a man of renown, you know, right now. And elevate above my, my teachers. <clears throat> now you read in the book, of, <clears throat> I'm sorry, the book of Maccabees. Who was that that tried to make a name for itself and slid up under the elephant? and killed it but the elephant squashed it. I forget the uh, the man's yeah, name. Jonathan. Was it uh Jonathan? Yeah the pastor just spoke on it uh I believe that was uh, Oh I didn't even know that. Yeah. I didn't even know that. You won the son. Okay. <laughs> That's the spirit. Yeah the son. <laughs> yeah uh so these guys want a name for themselves and that's not what this is about man. This place is about to be destroyed. These people out here have a, don't have a clue that destruction is on its way. But you do you do have your uh, doomsday preppers. You got some Jakes that's Uncle Tom's that then uh, that's following the uh, basically that's following the pattern of, of these these Edomite doomsday preppers. But that's very few, you know, niggas. Because I ran into a nigga. Uh, you know, on the job I work, and he and he and he into preparing for uh, basically civil war when the you know when the when the government declare war against the uh, American citizens, you know. So he's prepping for that. But the vast majority, they don't have a clue of the whole <coughs> uh, agenda of your how about shum your how shot man. Cause they think some way, somehow, like those doomsday preppers, they think some way, somehow, they gonna overcome the government, you know, overthrow the government, and reestablish this bullshit ass uh, democratic republic. And that ain't happening, man. Your how about stream your house side is throwing this fucking wicked ass kingdom down, and he and he taking it down for for good. Kind. The so-called white man that rules in this place, Esau, you Edomites, <coughs> you going down for good. That's right. And you never coming back in the rulership. You know? Matter of fact, you're gonna stay in servitude until that cursed flesh is uh no part of the earth any longer. Kind. You know? Read that again, I kind. Seeing then that all these things shall be dissolved, what manner of persons ought ye to be in all holy conversation and godliness? Right. <clears throat> Thermonuclear destruction is coming. And it's going to dissolve these buildings. It's going to dissolve the elements in the, of the body. It's going to dissolve the concrete of these streets. The vehicles. <clears throat> Everything, everything is gonna be melted over here. All the elements that you uh, see on American soil will cease to exist. What should you be doing? You know, teaching the flat earth doctrine, 
worried about the woman at the well, you know, uh, she, she had to be an Israelite. You know? God. Being a disobedient uh, son to your, to your uh, spiritual fathers. Did you find that account? I'm look, I you almost, looking for I almost it? got it. So, yeah, man. Uh, America is going to be destroyed. And uh, it needs to be destroyed. There's nothing but wickedness out here in, in, in these streets. <clears throat> and the Most High is going to put an end to it. Uh, get uh, Ecclesiastes 3 and 1. Con, this is Ecclesiastes 3, verse 1. To everything there is a season and a time to every purpose under heaven, under the heaven. A time to be born. A yeah, so you can stop right there. <clears throat> so, to uh, every purpose under the heaven, read it from the top, all right? To everything there is a season. To everything there is a season. And a time to every purpose under the heaven. And a time to every purpose under the heaven. You know, which is talking about under the, 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 the firmament. You know, of the the globe. Not, not the flat earth. You know? The, uh, the creation that you see before you. You know? So I just want to throw that out there about you know the mind, the mentality that you know we should have, and the and the brothers that's you know this this is not to the brothers like I'm teaching uh or giving a, a it's basically words of encouragement. You know what I'm saying? Just to add on to all the uh, energy that's been pushed out by the apostles and uh, other brothers. You know, <clears throat> that's basically, you know, pushing that energy out there, that, um, or that vibration out, that this is not a time to be playing games, man. A time to be, uh, serious when, when this place is about to be destroyed, man. You don't, I don't want to get caught up in this destruction. And I know the, <clears throat> the, the serious brothers out there, they don't want to get caught up. And this destruction that Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai is going to send. Right. The scriptures say that it's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living power. You know? And that is a fearful thing to know that you don't have the covering of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai to protect you. You know? <clears throat> and that he's leaving you open uh, basically for Satan to have his way with you. And Satan's physical counterpart is Esau. So Esau is going to have his way with you. You know? And now we're going to have our time, you know, to get our glory. The ones that uh, stand <clears throat> and endure to the end stiffly for this word are going to get a crown. You know? Are going to get spiritual bodies. Spiritual power, you know. Then that's the time to glorify, you know. Right now, Jake's trying to get his glory by by coming up with this this uh this unknown doctrine that they didn't they didn't supposedly meditate, you know, <laughs> meditated on, and now they got these these breakdowns, man. And I'm not just talking about the flat Earth doctrine, man. Because, you know, we just don't know. Who else out there in Great Millstone, uh, the camps, you know, or, or that follow, you know, the teachings of Great Millstone, they got these secret doctrines in their mind, they just ain't bringing it out. You know? Now that shit gonna come to the forefront, man. If you got something in your mind, a, a doctrine, or uh, a uh, uh, breakdown in, in, the, in the scriptures that you say it, 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 it's a different breakdown <clears throat> from what I was taught by, by my teachers, the apostles. It's going to come out. 